Hello, my lovely fart faces. Today we're going to do a post review from Dime Moon Shop. I'm doing one of Yolandi. So if you are new here and you like diamond painting videos, go ahead and click the subscribe button. I post new videos on an almost daily basis. This is my cat. So he's asking you to subscribe. There's my other cat. Okay, this is this is enough, baby. I need to show the people. Here is a thumbnail of the piece we'll be looking at. And it is 50 by 50. And here's how you spell. I don't know if I was pronouncing her name right, but it's Eva Gamayan. And um, this is from Dye Moon Shop. So dun, dun, dun. Is that, <laughs> is that a good way to present a canvas? Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I feel like, I don't know why I did that. Anyways, guys, so this is Leolandi from D Outward. She is a member of the music group, group band, uh, D Outward or Die Outward, but I've been corrected by Charnay, who is South African and they are a South African band. So it's D Outward, D Outward. I really love how this turned out. I got the middle size, so I didn't get the smallest, I don't think, and I didn't get the largest, but I, I thought that this size would be good enough to show the details, and I think, like, from looking at it, I think it did a really good job with the size and the rendering. They did an awesome job. What do you guys think of the size that I got? Again, this is 50 by 50. With Dye Moon Shops, you get the thumbnail and the legend. It comes lined up at the bottom. I accident I actually ended up cutting it off because it was like when I was working up there at the very top, it was hard for me to see the legend, so I ended up cutting it off. It came with 38 colors. Here's the schematic. Sorry for all the shadows, but that's the schematic. And as you can see, it did come with an AB, so AB310. I ended up not using any ABs in this canvas because I didn't want to take away from the image. And basically anywhere where there was black was supposed to be 310. And I was like, mm, I don't really feel like doing that. So I just used regular 310. And thank goodness that the kit comes with the option of three regular 310. So it comes with 310 ABs and three regular 310 in the same amount. So whichever you choose to use, you can. I really love how it turned out though. The rats are probably my favorite part of this diamond painting. Uh, we can take a look at the detail in the rats. So like from close up, you can't even tell like, you're like, what is that blob? But from far away, you can definitely tell it's a rat. And I love how her eye is just black. I think that turned out really cool. I know that this diamond painting isn't for everyone, but I really love how it turned out. D Outward, I really like the band. I like I like their music. I like their style. I think they're very unique. I don't know if they still make music, actually. I'll have to look to see what their latest single was really when their latest single was released. But yeah, if you haven't heard of them before, definitely recommend. I'll put a link down below to one of my favorite videos by them. So make sure you check them out. But I think like this, this canvas turned out perfectly. I'm really in love with it. I'm going to hang it on my wall. I might end up cutting off this entire border and just hanging it like with the drill field area and not the border. Or I might leave it on the border because, or the border on because I do have a 60 centimeter frame coming, uh, like a magnetic holder frame. Uh, wall hanging frame coming and I think that it might look better without like five centimeters on each side so I might I don't know I'll just see like because I like being able to switch out diamond paintings that I have on display so I might just leave it but this is definitely going on my wall because I'm very happy with how it turned out again like I didn't get the largest image but I think the rendering the rendering was really well done like I can you get a good amount of detail and you can see everything in this diamond painting with the drills one thing that I did notice and I noticed it with earlier diamond shops too with the drills I noticed that there was for certain colors there was a lot of trash like little smaller drills um weird cutout drills awkward sizes and that wasn't a huge deal because I had enough left over 
that I had enough to finish the diamond painting, but because I'm a multi-placer user, I ended up having to shift my tray around a lot so that I could get like those six six drills lined up properly without it picking up any trash, etc. But again, it wasn't that like it wasn't a deal breaker because I did have drills left over. What do you guys think of this diamond painting? It's definitely one of my favorites that I've done and I'm really glad I ordered it. I'll put the information for this canvas on the screen here. I will also put a link in the description box to the unboxing video in case you were curious about seeing the canvases without the drills on. Oh, and there was lots of confetti, lots of confetti tons of confetti, but I think it was worth it because of the detail you get. Let me know in the comments down below if you like how this turned out. I know it's not for everyone again because not lots of people like rats and not a lot of people like Deantward or have heard of them, but if you check out their music video down below, you might become a fan of them or you might hate them. <laughs> I can't say. Uh, that's all I have for you guys today. If you have any questions about this canvas, leave them down below and again comment and let me know what you think and how this turned out should i have gotten a larger size was this size good enough for detail i think it's really sparkly like if i go like that you can tell the sparkle and i'm going to do another dye moon shop kit soon anyways that's all i have for you guys today if you're new here and you made it this far and you found this video was helpful to you go ahead and click the subscribe button i post new videos on a regular basis and i'd love to have you as part of my hive okay bye